spring collection of the 2011, I decided to take the painting with a soft approach. In a sense, um, as if we were being washed by the clear water of um, a waterfall. The function of this particular work is really to create a universe in which the viewer can rest and, and, and become whole, use it as a medicinal uh, attribute so that their life can get better just through the very observation of the work. Uh, one of the essential aspects is to be somewhere doing the routine of the day and then knowing that it's time to take one step, another step, another step again and enter the field of the painting. At that very gateway, there is that sense of wanting to open the veils of the unknown and, um, and throw self in. And suddenly the eruptions of colors, the eruption of forms, the merging, the marrying, the disappearance, the reappearance, the scratching the surface, the softening the edges, all those gestures become part of the yoga of the painting life itself. One of the certain discoveries that I've made is that I am indeed a celestial navigator. Celestial Navigator is um, somebody who is dedicating life towards uh, entering the field of what is called the pure lands, of finding the unison between the ordinary self, which is very uh, part of our necessity of being, but that very ordinary self is able also to create a unison with the spirit part of self. Um, now I am actually creating maps with graphite, uh, there are lines that then will become invisible sometime, invisible other times, but they, they kind of delineate uh, the form of the painting. Now I have to choose within those forms, colors and influences that make a, a language out of the painting. Oftentimes, my colors are dictated uh, by a couple of major influences, one being the sound that surrounds nature in the very moment that I'm painting. And at the same time, the shapes and forms of sunlight, of moonlight, of uh, shadow cast, of winds coming through, and the uh, time of the seasons. All those elements kind of fuse into one instant uh, of color mixing, taking pigments and mixing them spontaneously in that very moment by uh, kind of glimpsing uh, outwards and, and, and then this dialogue of outward influence fuses with the inside um, knowledge that I've been developing over the last half a century as an artist and then suddenly it, the, the very piece of paper that was once flat opens all new horizons and universes and mind and body and spirit travel at the speed of light and um, Sometimes um, it's a great pleasure to be on this vessel, uh, kind of pushing forward, uh, pushing forward and pushing forward. <laughs>